Okay, a very quick video. My plan this week was to do an extended video of me managing trades. I made a video last week of me kind of talking about how I manage trades and everybody loved it. I received so much positive feedback and my plan this week was to do an extended version of it. However, I'm not going to have any time because I have just literally come back last night from Turkey. I got in my house at 5 a.m. I have not been asleep yet. So as soon as I finish recording here, I'm going straight to bed. And then tomorrow, I'm going back to the same airport to fly out to Amsterdam to meet uh, some BD members. So I literally will not have any time this week to do like an extended long video for you. So I'm going to save that for next week. I'd rather do it properly and professionally so you get better value out of it. So basically short and sweet video this week, still smashing it. Mogwai reversal strategy, London Open. Oh, you know what? I'm in a very good place with this. I just want to show you my results for today. So as you can see there, those are my results for today. Uh, gold and Euro, which you'll see here. This is my entire week. So 1,100 for the week. And if you just take a note, take a note of something. All Euro USD. Oh, hold on. Yeah, so basically I didn't pay, take many trades because I'm only taking one trade a day. I'm literally taking one trade a day. But as you can see, you, look, 33 grand for the month, yeah? And look at all the trades. Euro USD. Okay, Euro USD. See? Euro USD. Okay, Euro USD. And you see that it's not, you know. Now, how? How am I doing it? So basically, I'm in a very good place with my trading. Everyone else is with a BD member. We are literally smashing it. Mogwai reversal strategy at London Open, MACD Arrows, okay? I'm gonna quickly show you, okay? Because like I said, short and sweet video is just to let you know I'm still here, we're still smashing it, okay? So obviously, here, here you go here. These are basically just going over the MACD Arrows. May would have been 10%, April 17%, 16% in March, 5% in February, 17% um, in January, December 13%. I mean, literally, I mean, look, as you can see here, I'll go over it here, but this is essentially what we're doing. Euro TP hit, done for the day. Um, again, someone's in here. It I mean, hold on, if I could probably just go like this here. Look, you see, Euro USD, this was me. Uh, that's there. I mean, literally, everyone's just kind of smashing it. It's just epic. I mean, I, I, don't, I don't really know what to say. I mean, what's this here? Uh, let me go to message here. Um... It, it, like I said, right, let me just, I'll show you on the charts because I don't want to drag it out. Basically, this is why I love my trading at the minute, because we jump on the charts at 8 a.m., right? We know exactly what time we're trading. We know exactly what currency pair we're trading, one currency pair. We know exactly what we're looking for, right? It's literally all I have to do is sit here, turn up, take some arrows, make money, go travel around the world. That's literally what it feels like at the minute, and I'm not... Everyone will will back me up when they say this. I mean, like I said, I'm going back to the members there, which kind of says here. But, you know, you can literally, if I just look at some results, because so many people have kind of looked into this and they're like, yeah, Jamie, you're on to something with this. Um, hold on here. Uh, photos here. There is literally going to be some back testing results. I mean, literally, what's this here? Um, I, I literally can't find it. Um, I mean, literally, I mean, let me just show you the charts, right? Because I don't want to sit here all day. But essentially, what we're doing is taking the first MACD arrow after London Open. So London Open appears, we take the first MACD arrow, okay? Any currency pair, any currency, it doesn't matter. NAS, crypto, gold, seems to work on everything, literally, right? Um, so as you can see here, um, MACD arrow, this was the first one, beautiful, okay, beautiful, 10 pip stop loss, well, 5 pip stop loss, 5 pip take profit on that one, okay, I want to show you yesterday's, I'll show you yesterday's, okay, so yesterday I wasn't here, I was on an aeroplane, but as you can see here, this was the first MACD arrow there, okay, 21 minutes after London Open, now, this one, and like I said, right, and I've been saying this, if it's not the first MACD arrow, it's the second one. One of these will be with the trend, 100%, right? This is what a lot of BD members have started to notice and go, yeah, actually, Jamie, you're on to something. So if you look at today's, right? Look at today's. You see how today's has gone flying, right? Because it's with the trend, right? Look at this one. The first MACD arrow was with the trend, 
Okay, if you look at the second MACD arrow, which is there, that one's against the trend. So first one, we made our money, done for the day, done. Okay, if you look at the second one, right, you look at the second one, okay, so this is yesterday, the first one was against the trend. Right, now we would have took this trade, I would have got out of break even maybe until when I got this sell set, set up. Then we had a Mogwai reversal set up, which is essentially just the MACD. If I turn that off, there's the second MACD arrow. And you notice how this one's with the trend, right? Well, that's what I'm saying. One of them is with the trend. So I jump on the charts at 8 o'clock on one currency pair and I know exactly what is going to happen. I know I'm going to get these setups, and one of them will be with the trend, one of them will be against the trend. And what members have done is they've started to simulate and notice, actually, yeah, if I go for a 1 to 2, 1 to 3 with the trend, and 1 to 1's against the trend, or whatever, like, I mean, I'm not going to go on and on and on, but essentially, we are still smashing it, okay, Mogwai reversal strategy, uh, I'm actually doing a prop firm challenge with this, as you can see here, this, I'm not even joking you, has 100%, I have not had a sick... That's technically a lie, but it's not a lie, let me explain. So basically... I've set up this small fivers prop firm challenge to kind of prove to you that, you know, London Open MACD arrows works. Once they get funded with this, I'll scale up to get 20 grand, 50 grand and 100 grand. And I've done it all from five grand. OK, five grand prop firm account costs like 35 pound. So from 35 pound, I will scale up all the way to 100 grand. OK, just from taking arrows. Now, I've actually had 100% with this, okay, as you can see here, but I have actually had some losses. Now, these weren't actually from London Open MACD arrows, okay? They, that was just me getting a little bit cocky because essentially, you know, when you're kind of doing so well on the charts and you're a bit confident, you know, you can take a bit of risk. OK, and obviously sometimes it pays off, sometimes it doesn't pay off. So the losses here weren't specifically London Open. OK, to give you an example here, if you just look at this one here, right, obviously this one here was London Open there. OK, this one here on the same day was a loss. That wasn't actually London Open. That was just me, Mogwai reversal strategy. OK, so essentially, like whether you believe me or not, all these wins here are all just London Open MACD arrows, okay? And just to prove it, we'll just pick a random currency pair. Let's just pick another one, GP CAD. Let's see how well London Open did on this one here. So first MACD arrow. Uh, so let's find today. Uh, let's find today. So it is going to be there. So this one here, the first MACD arrow after London Open is there. 8.58. Again, look, beautiful. Boom. OK, now this, this is what's interesting, is this is neither with the trend or against the trend because price is going sideways. See how it's chopping in and out of the EMA? But again, you know, one to one, one to two there would have been perfect. But yeah, quick video, absolutely smashing it. Love you all. You might, I might do another video this week if I get a chance to. Uh, if not, obviously next week will be all the kind of big extended videos of me simulating and, you know, kind of showing you how I manage my trade. So I hope you enjoy that video. Um, thank you for watching.